think you might stop now. <laughs> Hi, so today is the 28th of November and I just thought I'd start this one off again because I kind of like enjoyed the last one. Uh, this is my headset by the way, ignore the noise because I can't stop that. <laughs> it's a neighbor's. Hey. <laughs> this is a nightmare. That's just gonna be a thing. <laughs> it's been going on for days. I had a presentation and I think it went okay. I feel like, again, it could have gone better. Um, it was a pre presentation around equality, diversity, so it was, it was quite good. Um, I think it went okay, kind of. I'm a sort of person that needs to plan everything to like the ninth degree, like literally everything that I'm gonna say needs to be written down in front of me and I can read it and be happy. Uh, I didn't do that this time, uh, for the first time in my life I uh, did something called winging it. <laughs> and yeah, it could have gone better, but honestly quite proud of myself for doing that. Um, those who know me know how much of a big thing that is. This is my headset. So it's the Razer Kitty uh, edition because, of course, it is. I think I think the presentation went as well as it could under the circumstances, and yeah, that's kind of like my last big presentation for this year. Like that's it. That's all my presentations for um for twenty twenty two, which is crazy. So I've got to finish the write-up for everything that was kind of for today uh everything's because we had to create a website as well so i've created the website i've uploaded everything on there and yeah i think it's kind of getting to a point where it's like all i need to do is put it in a submittable document and it's crazy to think that that's it that's the whole first semester for that module just done i mean i've done like i've done all the write-up i just want to read through and double check it because because i can but um yeah for the most part i'm just it, i've done the work for the module like it's crazy <laughs> um one so that's that one module fully done uh my second module is about data analysis so it's quite excel based business based etc and one of my spreadsheets has one line where the data is just not adding up to their like checkable figures so I don't really know what's going on with like all my numbers or my Excel, anything. Like, I don't know what's going on. And I spent two hours of my life shouting at it last night. And I'm probably going to spend a further two hours shouting at it again. Do it. Well, yeah, for that, I've just got to make sure my numbers are right on Excel. And then I need to write a 2,500 word report. Um, So at least I've kind of got one whole module finished so that I can concentrate on this. Because, uh, yeah, we'll see. Uh, the first one I was on about is due on the 8th of December. So got about just over a week um the data one is due on the 15th of december so a little bit longer thankfully i've got um something that's called understanding people and it's quite psychology sociology based it's uh yeah a bit crazy uh but that is an online exam uh multiple choice exam and that is in i think it's like 13th of january it's quite like mid-january as far as coursework is done, like as soon as these two pieces of coursework are done, that's two of the three modules finished and then that's it. Semester one is just done. It's it's just done. <laughs> it just seems crazy that time is just flying. Absolutely flying. I mean, I started in September. It's literally the 28th of November today. Like I've been there two months. It doesn't even feel like it. It's crazy. I have a lecture in five minutes so i'm gonna attend that is online so i'm not like rushing anywhere thankfully today is a bit well this week is a big week i have my last concert rehearsal tomorrow i play violin in an orchestra and our last rehearsal is tomorrow i'm the secretary of the orchestra so it's taken me like a week to get a venue booked for this last rehearsal and our concert is on saturday and oh i don't know i always feel so nervous because i'm the event booker so it's like every time it's like have i done this have i done that have i oh have i made sure everybody's right is the booking actually gone through and it's just so much stress and yeah so i've got that on top just on top of everything because of course it is <laughs> hi so today is the 30th of november and i look awful i'm aware 
it has been a day i am here with all my stuff my cables my computer and i need to reset this back up so i've got a busy day yeah i just thought it might be cool to kind of watch me put my setup back together again slowly getting there there's a um, few new things to my setup i have my razor kitty krakens um i'm still sort of trying to work out how to use them i've got my brand new elgato face cam which i've not even turned on yet and i'm actually trying out a brand new mouse so this is the razor orichi orochi this one <laughs> um yeah i've always used the logitech mx mini mice i have two of these i love them that much and this was on black friday sale for like 25 pounds and it was like this is a 70 pound mouse for 25 pounds like so i got it to try i thought that was a bit of a steal because i've always been looking for like the MX minis are fine but like they they sometimes lag on some games like shooters they're not good with their lag um so I was gonna give this a go to see how good it is the problem I have with most like generic mice let me just put you down the problem I have with most generic mice is that simply my hands are too small so I thought it was really good to just have a quick a quick look because this MX5 is uh, MX Anywhere 2S is definitely like perfect size for me and you can see how much bigger the Onrichi Orichi I still don't know how to say that uh you can see how much bigger it is and I still am not convinced if if this is a problem for me still. Um, at the minute it feels quite big, not gonna lie, but I don't know if it's because I've got used to these. So I'm gonna give it a go, because even if I just use it for like the odd game, it should be fine, right? Right? So yes. Also, this is non-rechargeable batteries, whereas this one is. So... I don't remember the last time I held an actual battery so I might have to purchase some rechargeable versions of these ready to go I guess how do I get it in how do you get it in do you say top off so it takes double so this is a double a one double a or one triple a battery and it also has the Bluetooth thing in here. I don't need to use that because I already have a Bluetooth thing in my computer. Um, so you should just be able to, it looks weird, put that in there and then... I mean, that was a happy click, right? We'll see. Uh, anyway, I need to see if I've kind of set my computer up right because my for the last uh, eight, no, ten weeks, my desktop has been at my boyfriend's house, not at mine, and now all my lectures have kind of disappeared for this for the winter for Christmas period. It's kind of no point me spending more time here when my desktop is at 
you know, at the other place. So I've, this is why it's being in transit and moving. It also means that I can't bring all my Warhammer here. Um, cause it's just, it's so much. So I can't bring my Warhammer here. So for the winter, I'm going to have to just stream games, which is a bit of a, bit of a bummer because I was really getting into painting. Um, but I, I can't, I can't help the situation, it's fine. So I just need to make sure that I'm set up ready for streaming for gaming. I've got the new base cam as well on a pretty good Black Friday sale, so I'm gonna give this a whirl as well. Um, I'm not quite sure how it works. It's been a long time since I've set up a proper camera. I mean, I used to use my, hang on. <laughs> this is to keep my camera from falling. Uh, well, it's actually to keep the dummy battery in. But I use this uh, Canon uh, EOS M50 Mark II. Look a bit of a better angle. Let's see if this works. I was gonna spend a bit more time setting all that up and then probably just play some games for tonight and then call that today. So yeah, I'll catch up with you really soon. So I don't really know what to do with tea. We'll see. I also don't know what the audio like is like in here. I'm in the kitchen, which uh yeah. <laughs> very echoey, very big room. Um that's not the kitchen, obviously, that's just a little snug. Um Looks cozy though, right? Looks pretty nice. Uh, let me put you down. There we go. Hi. Uh, so yeah, so today is the 1st of December. Like, December? How? Where has 2022? Yeah, I don't really know what to do with myself. I've got a parcel to go pick up, so I should probably go do that. So I might just be really bad and get takeout for lunch. I think in the last video I mentioned about a presentation that I did um, and we said, they said that they were meant to get the results in three weeks and today is exactly three weeks since our assessment so I don't really know it, it's like 40% of the whole module it's, it's not a lot but I kind of want to know vaguely where I am marks wise as to not how much effort I need to put into this, that's the wrong wording, but how how technical I need to get in this report. Um, so I've not really decided what to do there, to be honest. I don't think I can be bothered doing any work today. The problem is when I've been working in the past, I just work and work and work and work and work and there's no break. And I don't have that nine to five structure like I used to do. With, the uni student, with being a uni student, it's just whenever you can or whenever you feel like it. And it's it's difficult in a way because I, I have trouble sitting down and actually concentrating enough to be able to do this sort of stuff. But when I actually do sit down and do it, I damn well sit down and do it. <laughs> like, out of the three modules, one is an entirely exam. I haven't done any work on that yet. That is going to be soon. Then my other two... Uh, one of them I've done all the writing for. I just need to put it in an acceptable, submittable document type thing. And then the last one is this data analysis where it's 40% presentation, which I've done. Yay. And then it's also 60% this report, which they've given us like four weeks to do it without any or much help. So... I might stream later actually. I haven't I haven't because of all this work, I haven't streamed in like a week and a half and I feel awful. 
but it's just it's just been hectic like i've moved basically moved house without taking all my warm <laughs> so i don't have any warmer in this property um so I, I can't do any painting for Warhammer, so I think I'm just going to have to maybe stream some games tonight. Um, so yeah, I'm really into Valheim at the minute. It's an absolutely amazing game. I love it. I am back parcel acquired. This is good. And uh... maybe bad. I'm just gonna do one of those hey fun fact about me type things. Um, I play a musical instrument. <laughs> I play the violin. <laughs> I've been playing for like, since I was seven. I'm now 28. So I've been playing a long time. <laughs> so I have a concert on Saturday. I'm gonna do a bit of quick practice. You're not gonna hear it though. I'm not that good. <laughs> So yeah, I'll uh, just thought I'd quickly show you. What I did want to show you, hang on. Crazy. I got myself, this is my music stand. I will make sense of it in a minute. Um, essentially, I use my iPad for my sheet music. So this comes on. Uh, yeah, anyway, I'll build it in a minute. What I was curious is about is, I've just bought this brand new attachment for said stand just to see if I could get it to hold my violin as well because the amount of times it's like you have to put your violin down or your bow down because you're not playing or it's a whole thing. Um, so I was just gonna try this out before I try this out in the middle of a concert uh, on Saturday. Uh, so unscrew. Pull, pull. Uh, trapped on myself. Uh, let's not have uneven ground. Instead of holding an iPad after all, and a violin. I've not actually played this at like full height because I'm the sort of person who has a. That's too high. Like that. <laughs> this is why I was to try it out, is to know how. how, how oh, please? Oh. I got to make the stick longer. Amazing. So I'm gonna just tighten that here so it's kind of on the um you know, of course there's like a a thing here where uh, the attachment is uh, you unscrew this and this tube goes up and down um so have the new attachment just above it so it's like a stopper on it so let me just add my uh my things just come off Oh no. I'm breaking everything now. Ah, uh, it's because the pin wasn't all the way through. There we go. Anyway, the ball at the end of this attaches in, in, in. And then you just tighten it up like so. And then you can put your iPad on. Uh, if I could get the correct angle, please. Uh, okay, let's attach that. Tighten that. Are we done? I use an app called Fourscore for my music. Do you like my sticker, by the way? I love it. Um, so, yeah, so goes on that, attaches on, spin it the right way, make sure it's tight and then let me get the correct up and then you can have your music. If I move it to the side like this, because I don't need it all the time, it's just when I'm not risking my violin's life. I love it. I actually love it. And then I've got my bow. And I believe that you can just... I love it. I'm gonna have to show you. So this is the setup. So I have my iPad on its stand, which is all the way here, and it's that three-piece bottom. And 
this attachment i've kind of got it let me rotate um so i've kind of got it like this so it's almost like sticking out from the side so it like hooks the violin here quite nicely honestly and it's also holding the bow on a little sticky out thing but like it is actually it is actually like perfect honestly and i no longer have to leave the violin on the floor in the middle of concerts oh my god my life has changed this is amazing uh so yeah so i better actually do some practice now so uh i need to just take a pause i just got my results back from my presentation that i did i think i put a clip earlier even in this uh vlog where i was like oh i'm sure we're supposed to have our results i just got them i'm <laughs> so i so this module um this presentation was worth 40 percent of one module at maximum so in the in the whole of this presentation the pre out of a hundred percent on this presentation i got 72 percent 40 percent is a pass and a 70 percent is a first degree i didn't even know i was capable of getting anywhere close to like first degree level and granted this is first one i'm a way ahead of myself but like 72% <laughs> I can't believe it I just it's... there wasn't a single piece of negative feedback either That's so that equates to 28% of my entire module on data analysis so I've just done 28% of my my degree uh, my module which means which means I only, well, a pass is 40. Like, I'm, I'm already nearly... <laughs> I'm 28% of the way there already. That's bonkers. Okay, I really need to actually write the report now and actually, like, you know. <laughs> well, it's been a few days. <laughs> it is the 5th of December. So I had a concert on Saturday which went really well and I spent most of Sunday dying because I play violin so your arms are like in that position for like eight hours on concert day which is uh, not fun <laughs> so yeah so concert went really well anyway um had like the biggest crowds that we've had in a long time which was really nice to see um so yes um I have a lot of uni work to do this week. I have a deadline on the 8th, so I have like three days eek, for the first big submission, which is crazy. Oh yeah, and I've got my data analysis on the 15th as well, so I've got that. I've not even started that, so I've got that to write as well. So, stress is incoming. <laughs> what I'm hoping to do is try and get this vlog, keep this vlog going until after my submissions and then I can edit and then I will like do a new vlog from from that day onwards but um oh the stress the stress such a beautiful day today but oh my goodness is it so cold <laughs> yes yeah, so i have a deadline for tomorrow so i'm just going through the finalities of my document it is currently at 5854 words i'm just in the process of doing that and oh my goodness submit tomorrow that's my first big submission it's crazy and also i've one week left at uni before the Christmas holidays and I don't actually really know where the time's gone. Like that's it, semester one. <laughs> Take done.
just finalised my document. Oh, so all I need to do is submit tomorrow morning and then that's it, one massive chunk done. It's a whole module, which is crazy. I look very pink. I have a pink background on my computer. As per usual, I look crazy. <laughs> it is a beautiful day today. The sun is beaming in. It is the 8th of December. Oh, today is submission day for my first big submission ever, so... Oh, I'm nervous. Oh, I just wiped myself in the face, that was... Uh... I am just about to submit and I just eat. <laughs> okay. So I'm just like, too far. You're so low. Hang on. There we go. I have two submission points, um, so I'm just trouble checking out everything. <laughs> Um, okay, so submission, it is there, it is uploaded, comments, I'm just about to hit something. Let's do it with me, let's do it with me. Oh my god, is it doing it? <laughs> Submitted. <laughs> got the view on, got the view on. I'll just drag and drop. That's pain. Submit. Submit. Do whatever you do with me. Submission complete. Oh, it's gone. Submission complete. So that is that module completely done. It is a beautiful day today. I've got the sun coming in. Um, there we go. <laughs> It's beautiful. I actually have my hamster back up here now. <laughs> um, she's been living downstairs over the summer because it was just so hot up here in the rafters of the house. So yeah, so she was cleaned out yesterday. She's now back here upstairs in the warmth and yeah, she's just sleeping at the minute because she does in the daytime. But yes, today I am just working on my data analysis project. It's... <laughs> It's getting a bit much, let's be honest, but it's, we're getting there. I'm currently watching Lone Fox whilst I work, just to kind of give me a little bit of something. And I, can anyone help me? What, why does my hair do this? It's, it's annoying. But yeah, so I'm watching Lone Fox whilst doing my work. Um, I've got a lot to do. It's due next Thursday and it is currently the 9th and it's due on the 15th, so. Uh, I guess watch me work again. <laughs> oh, this is so not interesting, but this is life. This is just what life is, so. So today is the 13th of December and probably the last video of this vlog. Um, at this point I have one more report submission on Thursday. Uh, today's Monday. Um, so I have one report due on... no, today's Tuesday. Tuesday. <laughs> I have a report due in two days. Um, I've kind of written it, but I'm at that point where I leave it for a day or two and then go back and review and just absolutely make sure everything's okay and then I can just submit and forget. And then that's it, that's my semester one basically done. Um, I have one exam in January, so it's probably going to be a little bit revision over the Christmas period. Um, so we'll see, we'll just take it as it comes. Today's plan is to do kind of some mock exam questions for said exam in January just to kind of see where I'm at and kind of what areas I need to actually work on. Um, so I'm going to do that today. Um, and I'm also meeting up with my um, ex-workmates um, for Christmas dinner, which I just, I didn't think I'd be invited. Um, <laughs> and they did. And it's, it's just really nice that they've done that. <laughs> to be honest, because they didn't need to. Um, so yes, I'm going for Christmas dinner today with Mike's work, which is going to be really nice. Um, but yeah, other than that, I'm just, <laughs> I 
I'm, I'm just revising and working and <laughs> life. <laughs> um, I'm just gonna do a few more, um, probably a couple more time lapses just so you can see what I'm doing. But I think other than that, it's probably gonna be the end of this video. Um, so yeah, just uh, come study with me for a little bit, and I will uh, see you next time. meant to be revising. What am I doing? Putting my Christmas tree up. <laughs> By Christmas tree, I mean trees. Plural. Yes, this is my bathroom. <laughs>